I like when my cousins visit me. I'm four as well. I have four brothers. I don't live at home because I wasn't safe. I am five years old. I entered foster care when I was a baby. My casa is always there for me. She entered foster care when she was 12 years old. I was able to help get her an IEP, something that her social worker wasn't able to attend to on a timely fashion. I feel now we've connected um, in ways that I didn't expect that we would be able to connect. Um, it's interesting to see her flourish and thrive. After CASA was involved, I believe she has more structure and stability. I, I feel she is more confident and that things will work out or that she has someone to lean on. My Casa Child was about 10 years old when he first became visible to foster care, let's put it that way, and then eventually he was in foster care, probably around the age of 11 or 12. My first feeling was shock after I read the background about what he had experienced and the choices that were made um, by his grandparents. It just really surprised that he would be in this type of a situation. I have spoken to his counselor on a number of occasions. We're keeping track of his performance, his academic performance, and I think we all know that children need some level of of ability to depend on the adults around them. And so by being there, and being there at least once a month, if not more, it's provided that for him. Well, before CASA, he was still moving around and buffeted by going from place to place. After CASA, at least he's got at least one more person that he can rely upon. He was, I believe he was 12 when he first entered into foster care. He entered foster care due, due to behavioral issues, I think, with um, you know, just lack of family and environment that, that he was living in at, at the time. So he acted out a bit, and you know, that's, that's kind of how he got into this. I felt a, a little bit concerned um, when I first heard, heard the details of the story just because of some of the circumstances that surrounding it. The most important thing I think I've done for him is just being a different voice for him. You know, outside of the outside of his family, outside of you know um, the division, outside of lawyers and caseworkers. Even at, when my CASA term is over, you know, I told him that hey, you have my number. If you need something, call me. I am whole because I'm CASA. Thank you, CASA. I love seeing my casa. Thank you, Casa.